I started in track because my older brother, they couldn't get him to do any sport, my parents, and so they're like, we're just gonna sign you up for everything. And of course, because my brother wanted to do everything, pretty much we got here from doing that, just following my brother's footsteps. Kim Chapdelaine and Dwayne Lottick were my first coaches, and they were with the Langley Mustangs at the time. And they just had a love for the sport, which translated to me and all the other athletes that they coached. They always encouraged me to try everything. They were very good at guiding me to the opportunities that track could offer. It's really cool to look back and say, these are the milestones that I set for myself and to say to myself that I actually had achieved those milestones because it's rare that people say, I want to do something like the Olympics and actually fulfill that goal. The Olympics was one of those goals where I was like, I have to be okay if I don't make the Olympics as well because that can be very realistic and you have to be able to cope with the successes and failures as an athlete. I'm just over a year recovered from my Achilles rupture and I don't know where to start on that because I learned more about myself I think in that year than I had in like the four years prior. Um, not so much about my strength and my uh, ability as an athlete but more like if I can make it through an adversity at that magnitude then I feel like I'm equipped to make it through anything else you know and I think even in any competitions now um, I feel like that fear of potentially getting injured maybe or the fear of not doing well or the fear of like what if I fail all of that has gone out the window and so I think now I go into competitions being like a lot less scared of what might happen and more enjoying the moment more determined more just happy to be there like I get a second chance at this Langley is where everything started for me and so I think going back to that track and setting foot on that track although I've completely evolved as an athlete and as a person I feel like all those memories are going to be really beneficial for me it's going to be a huge sense of nostalgia like competing there and even seeing the people that I started out with they're still working there they're still involved in the club and that means that that club has such an impact on people that they want to continue with it and so not only did I make sacrifices as an athlete but all those people who are involved in my journey make huge sacrifices as well and so I want everyone to come I'm even though I'm nervous and it is going to be putting a little bit of pressure on myself I have to be like this is going to be an event for everybody like we get to enjoy my journey together and if and that means everyone can enjoy it with me, then I'm all for it and I want as many people there as possible so we can make it a fun event.